Hi guys, welcome back to our channel and in today's video we are going to determine the Lewis structure for SeO2 molecule. It's a chemical formula for selenium dioxide and to know the Lewis structure of this molecule, we are first going to look at the total number of valence electrons for this molecule. Now each oxygen atom over here has 6 valence electrons and even selenium has a 6 valence electrons. But as there are 2 oxygen atoms over here, we are going to multiply this number by 2 giving us a total of 18 valence electrons for selenium dioxide. Now selenium atom will here take the central position and both the oxygen atoms will be arranged around it like this and to show a bond formation between selenium and oxygen atom we are going to place a pair of electrons. So we have already used up 4 out of 18 valence electrons and now we are going to arrange the rest of the electrons around oxygen atoms first and then selenium atoms. So we will first try to complete the octets for oxygen atoms and now after we are left with only 4 valence electrons for selenium uh, you can see over here that selenium does not have a complete octet it just has 6 valence electrons. So as per the rules to attain a relevant Lewis structure all the atoms must have octet like stable structures. So we are going to try that by shifting a pair of electrons from this oxygen atom in the center and doing that uh, we will have 8 valence electrons for selenium atom as well and it will there will be a double bond between one oxygen atom and one selenium atom. Now um, to check if this structure is relevant you can calculate the formal charges of that and doing that you will come across that selenium over here has a plus 1 charge and oxygen has a minus 1 charge. In Lewis structures we try to attain a structure in which atoms have uh, formal charges as close to 0 as possible. So what we are going to do is we are going to shift another pair of electrons uh, in the center and then calculate the charges. and forming a double bond on both the sides you will get formal charge of zero on all the atoms and hence this is the lowest structure of selenium dioxide in which it forms this the central atom forms a double bond with both the oxygen atoms and I hope this video helps you to understand the Lewis structure for SeO2. For more such videos on Lewis structure, molecular geometry, polarity of the molecules, make sure to subscribe to our channel and thank you for watching.